Korea's new COVID-19 cases surpassed the 100,000 mark for the first time in more than three months on Wednesday. The government has decided to support those who take time off work to take care of their families. It is also urging the public to voluntarily adhere to social distancing and antivirus rules. Korea reported 100,285 COVID-19 cases on Wednesday. It's the highest daily tally since April 20th. 그 전주에 비해 85%가 증가하였습니다. 면역 회피가 높은 오미크론 변이의 검출률과 재감염 비율도 증가하고 있습니다. There were 532 imported cases, the highest since the pandemic started in the country. The number of critically ill patients came to 177, maintaining an upward climb in triple digits for a week. The government is urging the public to voluntarily stick to disease control measures. It also strongly recommended companies to give symptomatic workers time off. Also, a 50,001 subsidy is being given daily to a worker using leave to care for COVID-infected family members for up to 10 days. The support is available to workers, regardless of the business size, who use unpaid leave to take care of infected family members. Workers can apply through the Labour Ministry's website. Public workers are strongly advised to work from home and must undergo preemptive rapid antigen tests when they return to work. 국민 참여형 거리 두기는 어, 규제나 의무가 아닌 국민 스스로 실천하는 생활 속 방역 수칙 준수를 통해서 일상 방역의 생활화를 정착하고자 하는 거리 두기 수단입니다. Health authorities also recommended crowded private academies to hold lessons remotely.